guys and welcome back to my channel Katya Phuket for Team, it's my name and um, I missed you actually but I was so busy to make any videos with my training camp I just finished yesterday my training camp for tomorrow's fight yeah, as you got it from my comments or video like I'm supposed to fight on the 23rd of April of March, sorry but that fight was cancelled and postponed on the 6th of April. Today is my first day off after a really tough uh, training camp and I cannot thank my trainer enough. He just did everything for me this time and he worked so hard for this fight with me. Like he did clinching with me, sparring with me and of course he held pads for me but he just did so much work. I cannot thank him enough. Liam, thank you very much. But anyways, uh, today is my first day off and that's why I look pretty today and um, in today's video I'm going to show you guys how to recover after the training camp before the fight. So I have like literally two days, today and tomorrow, but tomorrow at night time, like after 9 p.m. I'm fighting, so for these two days I have to recover like totally and uh, I want to show you guys what I do to let my body rest enough and um, to recover all my muscle and um, all my body. Actually, it's so weird feeling like you just train all the time, like five days, five hours per day and then you just stop and you just like, what to do? <laughs> you like feel a little bit empty or I don't know, whatever. Really, I was like, I have so much time now, what, what, what should I do? Uh, yeah, and in this video you will see what I'm going to do. Yeah, I just ate for breakfast like a couple of bananas, but I'm still hungry, so now I'm gonna go to Tony's. Ah, don't ask me about belt, because I have no idea if I'm fighting, if I'm fighting for a belt or not. I was asking my trainer, like, Nim, am I fighting for a belt? He said, no, 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 not for a belt yet. But then I see like he was talking to the Thai trainers and uh, in Thai, and they could understand something. And he's like talking about the day I'm fighting, and then he showed like, this. and they were like oh <laughs> I'm like oh nice so I think he just like uh, kind of trying to save my mind or something I don't know she just she just cares about me and he just I think he just doesn't want to tell me like he doesn't want I think too much about that but it's okay we will see tomorrow <laughs> I don't know who my opponent is he said like Katya, it doesn't matter who you're fighting with. You have to, you just have to be ready for any opponent. And he's right, I think. It's okay. Um, oh yeah, and I got my posture. And here we go. I think uh, it's the prettiest photo I got for the posture for for fall time, but. And now, yeah, I have a new name, Gata. It's really something new, but it's getting closer and closer to my real fighting name, Kata. <laughs> okay, Gata, Gata, at least not uh, Gadja. Yeah, and else I have to do my laundry today. Look at this mess, guys. <laughs> my laundry basket is just full after all this time of training and all this mess. I have to wash all this. So I didn't have any fights whole March and I was like kind of frustrated because of that but now like on the one hand now I'm happy I'm fighting tomorrow finally I was looking forward for this so long but on the other hand I'm just sad because my training camp finished and uh, I don't know I just like it it's so tough and nice time like when everybody pays so much attention you and my trainer was like so concentrated at, on me and uh, I just like it, it's cool. You feel like something special is going on, you feel like mystery around. And then, yeah, the first time like my trainer he was, he worked so much. I think it's, it's gonna be like really serious and tough fight because he didn't tell me but I could see like he worked so much about that and he, um, spoke to me about that like so many times like God you win you win you have you have power you're okay like I can't even explain that but I just see because I know him so well. Yeah. Ok 
Okay, let's go to have a breakfast. And as my trainer said, what should I do for these two days to recover? It's just eat and sleep. <laughs> yeah, of course, to get strong you need to eat well and uh, luckily I don't need to cut weight so I can eat whatever I want. I'm just like trying to control what I'm eating, not to be fat in the ring, you know. <laughs> so let's see what I want. Oh yeah, here is what I got for my breakfast. Uh, it's like sandwich with a ham, I guess, yeah, and uh, some fruits and this mixed fruit shake. Let's have fun and bon appetit. And I'm doing my laundry. Ja, ja. Right here. Okay. Ah, it's stuck there. Oh. Got it. Nice. And I uh, just stopped at the gym to check out the big poster. They just brought it here. Yeah. Here we go. Nice. They look really good here. Gata. Nice photo. I like it. Finally, I got a good photo. Gata is ready for the action. <laughs> okay, now it's almost uh, lunch time and um, I'm going to meditate for about 40 minutes or maybe one hour. I got my incense sticks here. I just like how it smells. Yeah, and I need to get my dog back to the room. Nisha! First. Oi, it's raining. We got so dry and so hot season now in Thailand and everyone would be just so happy to get rain, but hopefully, at least it's not that hot. Okay, here we go. Baby goes home. I just really love meditation. It's such a great thing. It makes me calm and, I don't know, meaningful. And uh, I'm just feeling blessed. That. And I'm feeling like like very happy person. So yeah, this is how I do. I just sit on my on my bed. Make it like comfortable for me. I got my phone and uh, I'm going to put some like trance music on YouTube. So it helps me to meditate and to stop thinking about anything because. The main purpose of meditation is just to stop thinking, like to stop your mind and to have absolutely clear and empty mind. And uh, this is how you get like enlightened. After that, you just don't care about anything and you have just great feelings inside. This is my channel. Hi guys, how are you there? I have like my favorite list of such music for meditation and for relaxation. Look what we got here. Such a huge chicken and some wedges and rice. And boys, say hello. <laughs> and Yusuf, champion of the world soon. <laughs> and we have here Bangla world champion. Yes. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Future world champion. This Probably world tomorrow champion. I'm fighting for a belt at Bangla boxing stadium. <laughs> oh, look at the camera. Look. <laughs> yeah, so tomorrow I'm you're going to win? Yes, I'm going to. How are you going to win? What do you expect? How to win? Oh, fuck. I just do whatever I can, you know. <laughs> and I want to show you guys. The place I've just eaten, uh, it's called, what is it called, it's called Kun Kai Kitchen, yeah, here is Kun Kai, so, so she's the owner and um, basically it's just their house, so they live here and uh, outside they just 
placed some tables and uh, there is a kitchen where they cook food for customers and it's like traditional Thai place it's very common in Thailand just to open a small cafe or restaurant uh, right in front place where you actually live and it's a really nice place with the cheap and uh, with the cheap and tasty food so yeah I just picked up my laundry and now I have to dry it all I have so much stuff and like most of my laundry basket it's my Thai stuff very expected right yeah I think so My, my, my Thai shorts, sport bras and underwear. And for a dinner I just decided to go far and get my pizza. <laughs> yeah, and I'm not ashamed because that's what my trainer said me, just to eat and sleep a lot, to get stronger. To my fight. Hey, what time is that? It's nine forty PM. It's pretty early, but for me it's already a bad time. I feel very tired because I didn't even sleep today and uh, it's a bad time for me already saying bad I mean the bad not a bad time <laughs> it's uh, gonna be a good bad time and see you guys tomorrow bye bye good morning world yeah it's the second day of my recovery and uh, I'm actually fighting tonight and uh, Yes, I just unbraided my hair, so I look like a poodle. <laughs> it's around 9 in the morning, and um, yeah, let's get this day started. So for breakfast I'm having like kind of super healthy sandwich. Yes, it's steamed chicken and um, tomatoes and eggs, and one poached egg, fruits and a coconut. <coughs> <laughs> and now I'm getting my Thai massage here. Hello. <laughs> Some people don't uh, like uh, to get a massage in their fighting day, but I don't know, I just like it. I think it's cool. So let's get some relax. Massage was good. I just love it so much. And now I feel so much better. And yeah, it's time to become beautiful. <laughs> Else. Well, the weather is not hot, great. Yeah, today is also my beauty day, so this is what I'm doing. Pedicure. And manicure. Because I'd like to look gorgeous in the ring. I think first time for two months and yes I just did new style hair for my pipe it's uh, two braids here on sides and one on my back like for me I don't think about my upcoming fights almost at all sometimes I do but really little and uh, when you when you catch yourself like overthinking about that just you just have to stop doing it and I know it's re it's easy to say like just just don't think about that but hard to do but for me really like 
I meditate a lot and um, as, I, as I told you, the purpose of meditation is uh, to learn how to stop thinking, how to stop your mind and since you've learned how to do it in meditation, you can do it in reality, like in everyday life. And now for me, I got this skill already and uh, I just like... I just like have maybe really right and correct way of thinking like I know to think too much is just absolutely useless so I just don't do it and uh, I don't know I just live today and now and uh, I don't think too much about the future don't be scared and uh, think positively uh, time is 2.30 p.m. and for lunch I'm craving Chicken in Austria sauce and my favorite brown rice. It's 4.23 p.m. and I'm back to the gym and uh, my fight is getting colder and colder and now I just want to do some shadow boxing and stretching like to warm up my body because whole day I'm relaxing and do nothing and my muscles like, I don't know, sleeping. <laughs> I need to wake them up, you know. So yeah. very much. Remember, if you're sad, Julian from Australia, he loves you. <laughs> Somebody loves you. Somebody always loves you. Yeah. His name's Julian. <laughs> <laughs> now you know. Now you know. And my last meal for today, it's um, 5 p.m. Just a second. 5 p.m. and um, so we are leaving at 8 p.m. and this one my last meal for today before my fight and that's out meal. What are you were saying? Is this, have you already made weight? Yeah. I don't need to make, make weight. No? No weight. No weight in. I just have to get strong, you know. <laughs> okay, but so you don't ever have to step on scales. Yeah, no, like in big, big uh, fights in Bangkok, like, you know. On big promotion, yes, of course, but here it's like local fights, they don't give a shit a lot. They should do, but I don't know. They don't really do. Okay. Okay, I'm at home now, finished with my oatmeal. I just always eat oatmeal before my fight. It's like a tradition already. Just, I just believe like it gives me power. I feel strong, I feel good, and now I'm just going to have a rest until 8 p.m. 
that's it guys i'm ready to go to my fight wish me good luck and see you all very soon bye bye don't forget to subscribe on my channel and like this video below stay tuned